The Strategic Salmon Health Initiative, which SSHI, is really a study that is trying to determine the role of disease in determining the marine survival of salmon when they enter the sea. We've also detected for the first time a disease that is associated with salmon farming, which is called heart and skeletal muscle inflammation disease. So what we've really taken on is a study of the pathogens that exist in BC salmon, and we're talking about wild salmon, hatchery salmon, and aquaculture raised salmon. And we're documenting the existence of pathogens known to affect salmon from all over the world to see if they're present. But we could not have undertaken this study if it wasn't for the Human Genome Program, which is probably an interesting tie, but it's because they have developed new technologies that allow us to look at 45 different pathogens in any one run and up to 90 fish in any, any single analysis. So this to me actually completely revolutionizes the monitoring for pathogens and our ability to study the uh, risk of pathogen and disease in wild salmon.